Hello everyone, welcome back to Ratchet of Clank Platinum walkthrough on uh, Battalia. Let's go straight on with this. So um, I'm going to try and get a few worlds done on this part. Probably get about three worlds done. I don't know why I just threw that disco ball. Um, yeah, so uh, to begin, we're just going to head up here. And I actually want to change controls actually. On my um, other account, I've actually put this on normal and it's a lot easier to put it on normal. Yeah, it's a lot easier controls because you have, you've actually got shortcuts now. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't do this before. What a dick. Right, guys. Yes, we're back on the rail. Grinding the rail. Just watch out for these little electrical fields. Um, They will sting you quite a bit. This will be a lot easier on the second playthrough because we will have invincibility. And you can literally just sit through these. You still have to do the jumps and the um, end of the line sort of um, barriers will still kill you if um, you hit them but the ones that just do a little bit of damage like these you can just sit through these yeah I can't believe how easy it is on the second playthrough I guess technically they don't actually want you I mean because you take re you gain reduced XP um, with invincibility on they obviously I mean they don't really want you to do it but you can still do it and get XP, so it's not too bad. Yeah, jump right there, guys, to change the rail. And uh, this is the last one now and should take us to the part at the end where we get a info bot, I think. I think these info bots, um, they show up in... Yeah, watch the barrier here, so make sure you avoid them. Yeah, these info bots, I think they show up on... Um, you collect one and then another one will show up somewhere else. Um, uh, but this is the only one you sort of have to collect... For the story, I think it's an info bot. Yeah, this is the only one that you actually require to collect. Yeah, a little cut scene here that I'll skip. Right, thanks for that. Let's head back. Fast travel system. Right, let's go and get a rhino card. Rhino card number. I'm not quite sure what number rhino card this is, can't quite remember. Right, let's summon Zircon, and he can distract them for me. Yeah, obviously remember about using your um. Groovatron to make sure you get all the enemies. Right, that one goes there. Um, what about this one? That one goes. Yeah, that one goes there, and then I've got these two here. Yes, and there's one more. Okay. This one's going to be... Looks like it's going to be a pain in the ass for me. Um, that one was... Yes, I know that one's there. This one is... You sort of tell where they're going to... Where they need to go because... Oh, there, here we go. Ah, oh, that's the one. That's the one. Got it, finally. Yeah, here's your Rhino card, guys. Um, Rhino card number... I'll tell you in a second. Wait for it. Uh, it's Rhino card number... Uh, number six. Yeah, we've got, we com just completed another set as well. Rhino card number six. After you've got that, guys, jump up the wall here. And it'll take you to a gold bolt. Yes, gold bolt number... 13. I'll make sure I've got a uh, fast mode on. Yeah, you'll find every time you um, quit the main menu, you'll have to keep enabling the cheats. So, right, I've got fast mode on now. Right, make your way over here because you've probably just seen it there. It's rare, uh, rareitarium. No, Ratchet, what the fuck are you doing, you dick? Oh, God. Yeah, it's a rareitarium up there. So, I'll just get that, guys. There we go. Right, and uh, let's crack on with the main objectives. Okay. Did not expect that to happen. It caved in as I landed on it. I wonder why it was there. I thought, this is normally destroyed. I guess I was just a bit too quick. Slow down. Right, through here, secret wall. There's some rotarium in there, guys. 
Grab that. Then we need to make our way over here. Right, these... We have encountered them enemies, enemies before, but then ones throw grenades at you. So probably best... Any new, any new enemies you come across on any level, just... Um, yeah, lob the Groovatron down, just to be safe. Yeah, even even enemies that look the same, if they've got a different weapon, I'm not sure if that counts as a new enemy or not. So um, I just always lob it at them, just to be on the safe side, guys. Right, I think that's all the enemies. Let's activate this to um, make that bridge. Yes. Right, make our way back up. For fuck's sake, my platform is pretty bad at the moment. Oh. Okay, I'm up here. Yes, yeah, a tank there. Uh, but if you come over here, there's a gold bolt over here. I think it's a gold bolt. I couldn't quite quite recall if it's gold bolt where I tell him. Yeah, there we go. A gold bolt, guys. Number two on this level. Gold bolt number two. That's 14 out of 28. Right, then we're going to head back across. Yeah, you're going to have to take these enemies out. Because as you can see, your um, buddy there is trying to kill them all. Right, let me just take these out. Alright, we've got them all. Let's head on. Yeah, because she follows you, you normally have to kill all the enemies in the area before she'll actually follow you. Right, so we've got to pull this lever here. So, um, probably going to have to kill all the enemies. Yeah. Sometimes, oh, there we go. Yeah, sometimes you can interact with it before you kill the enemies. Um, but if you get interrupted. Oh, I did it at the time, but. Yeah, she'll normally. She normally won't follow you unless you've killed all the enemies. Oh, but it looks like she is. Okay, let's crack on then. And uh, once you're over here, we need to climb up that magnetic road. Yes, they could. Let me go and deactivate them for you. If you try and jump across, the turrets just kill you, like, instantly. So um, they really don't want you to just um, skip across a gap. I've actually fell off the magnetic road here sometimes. I'm not sure why it happens. I think the game just bugs out sometimes and um, you lose the magnetic field between your boots and the road. Well, I'd best be careful so I'm going to die in a second. Yeah, you'll get hit quite a lot on this next part. There's a lot of enemies so um, just be careful with uh, your health. Right, we've got to get up here. Um, Shit, oh, I'll, I'll go the normal way. Right, let's get Mr. Zircon. Let's um, use a disco ball. Actually, I'll put one. I'll love one of these down there as well. Holy fuck! This is what I mean. Look at my health. Nine out of fifty already. Yeah, so you have to come up here. Okay. Shit. I need to go and get some health. Phew, that's lucky. Well, let me just get rid of that fucking huge robot. Right, let's go and pull that lever now, guys. Oh, someone's still shooting at me. Hopefully he's going to miss. Yes, I did it. Why is she waiting? For she's got a jetpack, but she's waiting for me to um, send the bridge across. Right, let's get rid of these robots. Oh, I've got no Mrs. Zircons left. But it's a uh, Raritarium up there, guys. There we go, that's Raritarium. Right, just get the collectibles in this area before we kill the enemies. Because um, hopefully your friend's going to kill some of them. So through here, through this um, hole in the wall, there's another Raritarium. There we go. That's all the Raritarium here. Where's he going? Oi! 
And now we're going to try and get up here without having to. That's it. Climb up the boxes. And here's the last gold bolt, guys, for this level. I think that's number 15. Yes, 15. Right, let's get rid of these enemies. Yeah, just get rid of all the enemies and then the door will open up near the front. Two tanks will come out. Is that all of them? Yes, there we go. Right, let's um, Mrs. Zircon again. Yeah, so there's two tanks and there's some enemies near as well. That's it, that's the tanks down. Let's get rid of the um, mobs. Yeah, he's gone. Another tank uh, robot there. Right, once he's got them all, he can pull this lever and uh, open the door ahead, guys. Oh, shit. Mr. Zircon, where are you? Oh, just a bit... Oh, that wasn't Zircon. That was... Um, what's her face? I don't know what her name is. Whoever you are. Is that a girl that normally says that to you? Yeah, so um, there's... Yeah, four four Eritarium on this level, guys. We've got them all. There's that Rhino card, and you've got three gold bolts. But now we're just going to do the last bit of this level, and then we'll move on to the next world. Where we get the um, we get a new sort of movement ability. So what am I doing? I've got to do the trust do the trust pack lock first. Top tip there. Yeah, so now you can actually deactivate rings. Um, so this is a single one, so that obviously goes up there. Them two go there. And then the middle ring, you need to deactivate it. There we go. That one was nice and easy. Star Watch Defense Cannon. Right, guys. Starship Defense Cannon. I've always wanted to use one of these. You know what it looks like standing erect there. So just like most of the times when you're sort of flying a spaceship or a cannon... Um, yeah, just like your normal. You know what happens when you fly a cannon? Use a cannon, even. You have to shoot all the little ships to build up your ammo. And uh, then shoot the big ships with your bigger ammo. So, um, yeah. Just keep shooting the little ships. There you go. Once you've done that, shoot the uh, big ones. There we go. Make sure they're not too far away. If they're too far away, um, your big missile will not actually hit them. Yeah, it's a bit annoying, actually. One time I was doing this, and I must have wasted—I must have wasted about three missiles because they kept missing the ship, even though I was sort of on target, and they just kept blatantly missing. And I think it's because they're out of range, so I'm always make sure the sort of ship is close by. And you can't miss then, can you? The closer you are to your target, the easier it is to hit it. Yeah, well, I learned that somewhere. Yeah, I learned. I can't remember where it is. Maybe on um. Oh, what's that game called? Hono Montana. Yeah, maybe I learned it on that. Can't remember. But two more, two more down. Yes, here we go. He was just in range. Oh, I was a bit worried about that one. I didn't think it was going to be in range, but I hit it. Okay, yeah. Watch out for damage indicators on your hood. Because that's indicating these little missiles are coming towards you. And they will damage you. They will. They will damage you if they hit you. Yeah, that's what happens. When there's a damage indicator on your hood, it normally means something's going to hurt you. So, um, yeah, but it's, I mean, this is pretty easy. There's some of these, when you've got infinite ammo on, um, your ammo is just always full, even with the missiles. Right, come on, last one, please... Oh no, I need one more. I thought I had a full chamber. Right, let's do it. Please. Whoa. Oh my gosh. What an explosion. What a explosion there. Shot down your battle battleship. That's it. Go on, scram. Never come back here. The Empire will fall. Mark my words. Okay, we did it. No! Okay. We just did <laughs> we just did that and then we just killed ourselves. That was what I was born for. To take out that ship. 
There's no more. There's no more point in living on this planet. So let's move to a different planet. We're on Batalaria, Batalia, Batalia, and we're, now we're going to um, Pokitaru or something. I think it's called Pokitaru. There's only about six worlds left, and then we've completed the game. Yeah, literally about six worlds left. Yeah, see you in a bit, man. Oh, thank you. Do I get any? Do I get a raise? Yeah, let's go, guys. Pokitaru. So here we've got. There's three gold bolts. There's no rhino cards, but there is three raritarium, and we get the O2 mask, and we get a misc trophy as well. And we've got another bit where we fly a ship. I don't mean this ship where we land in. I mean we actually get to control a ship. Which we actually get to take control of the weapon. And uh, manoeuvring and controlling and flying. Right so first of all guys. We're just going to commit suicide. Why you may ask. Why, why not. I mean it's only a video game. Let's just kill ourselves. Now you have to let one of these big sharks eat you on here. On this world. Okay. And look, it's not even eating me now. Come on, eat me. There he is. Here he comes. Hey, buddy. You hungry? Yeah, poor sharks are the worst. I can't believe that shark killed me. They are the worst. Right, let's just... Um, yes. Get my ammo back up. Right, yeah, we're good, guys. So, we just got a trophy there. Let a poor shark kill you on this level. Basically, just dive to the edge of the map. And it will bite you. Right, we found the technician, and we, what you'll find you have to do on this level, you have to, yeah, you have to actually call the enemy so a technician will follow you. But use the Groovatron. Uh, yeah, make sure you use the Groovatron on this. And this enemy here, it looks like the brain monster from the other level, but it's, I think this one's a different colour. This one's purple, so it may be a different brain monster, so um, just kill that one just to be safe, guys. Uh, well, of course, kill it. I mean, but also make it dance just to be on the safe side. Yeah, just in case. Right. Oh, look, he's dancing as well. But the thing is, I don't want him to dance. Fuck. <laughs> okay, so don't use it on this little uh, raft we've got here. This hover hover raft. Guess you could call it. Right, I'm just using the Groovatron on every sort of enemy type we've come across. You shouldn't be able to go wrong then. Yeah, because like I said, even if you've come across the same enemy type but with, with a different weapon, I'm not sure that counts or not. So, um, be on the safe side. It's good to just make everything dance. Right, there's a gold... There it is, gold bolt down in this water here. Just be quick and get it. Here we go, guys. A gold bolt. So, that's where we are. Yeah, gold bolt there. Just dive down, quickly get it. It's, be a, it's underneath that sort of archway there. And then, yeah, once you've got that, come back out. Oh, fish are sleeping. Look at them. Where's um, Mr. Zircon? Yeah, he can help. We'll level them up a bit while we're um, killing these fish. I got knocked off. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, Mr. Zircon's gone, no wonder. Let's summon him back. Right, there we go. Right, once you get up here with the platform, once you've sort of um, parked up, drop down here. And just underneath here, guys, dive under. Yeah, there's a hole here. Just I'm just here to the left of that little island. Dive under here and quickly come through here before your oxygen runs out. And head up. That's it. Little secret here. Um, but there are some things here we need to get. So just on the corner here. Raritarium. Before we use the grapple hook. Yeah these birds. They're similar to the birds on the other level. But these ones are blue. Oh fuck. I'm almost dead. Yeah these ones are blue. So we're making dance. Right yeah. Get that raritarium and head across. Oh, I need some energy. Really bad. Oh fuck, I'm worried. I am worried here. And any energy here? Right, let's just lob some uh, let's lob a Groovatron over there. 
to um, protect me. Just be on the safe side. Right, wear some health. Yeah, some crabs here, but I'm not sure these are different type of crabs to the ones on that other level. So, um, yeah, make him dance, just be on the safe side. Right, Mr. Zircon. I think I'm going to have to die here and... Um, oh, there's some health over there, look. Right, that's a Groovatron. There it is. Yes, yeah, got some energy, guys. So, I'm up here. <laughs> and you need to kill this... Um, Brain monster that will appear in a second. Where is he? Oh, here he is. Holy shit. Right, you screw with Tron on him to um, distract him for a minute. There we go. Yeah, I think this brain monster is different to the one on that other level. Yeah, and he'll drop a gold bolt. Gold bolt number second, guys, on this world. Yes, thank you very much, brain monster. 1728. Right, once you've done that, we're going to dive over here. I'm going to get another Raritarium. Yes, health. Thank you. No, please leave me alone, crab monsters. I come in peace. Yeah, just going to get this uh, Raritarium over here. I always dive down, so I think you move a little bit quicker. Under I've said this before, but um, I will say it again. I think you move a bit quicker underwater. So Raritarium there, guys. You don't need to get all them. I'm just getting them so um, you can sort of upgrade your weapons a bit more. But you want to save all your upgrade materials, guys, because later on, not too far away, actually, we're going to buy this Sheepinator, and we want to try and upgrade that as much as we can, when we can. So um, I'm basically saving my um, Raritarium for that. Basically, there, there's some... Yeah, come up here now. There's some abilities that are trickier. They're trickier to um, use on most enemies. So, um, yeah, certain ones you need to use on ground enemies. And, yeah, so I just got rare Rotarium there again, guys. Yeah, and um, some of them, they will not work on bosses. So that's something else you need to keep track of. Right, so here's the technician. Now what we're going to do, we're just going to kill all the enemies along the way now, guys. And uh, clear the route for him, basically. So, yeah, just kill all the enemies. Yeah, so um, that's all them. He's going to follow me a bit. Right, get rid of these guys. Right, and the brain, uh, that brain monster will always appear, don't worry. Yeah, I think it's when the technician gets close to you. Yeah, I think that is a, I think that is a different brain monster to the one on the, um, uh, the um, fire level. Because the one on the fire, they're like red, aren't they? But that one's like purple. And the one here, it's got like a um, sort of protective shell around the front of its brain. I guess at least this at least this one's trying to protect its brain. Right. Once he's on the platform, we're gonna over there it's a third gold bolt on this level. Um, but just wait a second, we're gonna head over there in a second, we'll just let him get level with it. And then we're gonna shoot across. We've got three Raritariums so far on this level, there's actually one more. And it's one more gold bolt. Right, so we'll leave him there for a minute, don't worry, he'll wait for you. Right, let's head over here. And um, once you get over here, guys, so this is where I am. Just stay wait, stay still, and then do a double jump to get out. That's it. Just get up here. Up here. And then uh, hold R1. And uh, you should get up there. Yeah, third gold bolt, guys. And that's the last one on this level. And we've got one more rare return. 18 out of 28, that should be. Yeah, 18 out of 28. Right, let's get back to the raft now, the hover raft. I guess you could call it. Right, go for it, technician. He's definitely dressed for the weather. Right, where's his fish? Well, I've not got much ammo left. I'd best uh, keep that. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to use Groovatron. Let's use Predator Launcher. Bastards. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have used that. I think grenade would be better here, wouldn't it? Really. These weapons are shortcutted. I'm not sure if it's um, always the same weapons. 
Oh fuck, I'm almost dead. Five. How quick do you die on this? Yeah, a lot of people say this is easy. But I guess it is easy. I mean, you, it's not like there's a really bad punishment if you do die. You sort of, ju you know, you sort of just respawn in a sort of immediate area. Whoa! Almost fell down. Sorry about that. Little high pitched roll. Yeah, I mean, when you die, you actually respawn with your health and more ammo. So I guess it's an advantage to die. It's not like a punishment. Right, so we've got to kill all the enemies. So we can progress. Right, so disco ball time. Yeah, because Mr. Technician, he won't follow you if you do not kill the enemies. Right, so let's just quickly get rid of these. Oh, I've got full health again. Nice. Okay, is that all of him? Is he going to follow? Oh, no, it's one left guarding his house. Don't worry, no one wants to go inside your house. Right, let's um, go over here. Right, Groovatron time. Oh, level up, level five. Right, press the switch so we can... Oh, got to kill the enemies first, okay. I can't call Mr. Zircon because I don't think I've got any. Right, let's just kill these. Okay, out of ammo it looks like. Okay, they are my bolts, thank you. Right, press that. Mr. Technician will come over. There you go. Yeah, I didn't notice. Honestly, I never noticed, mate. Right, and we've got to kill just these enemies. Right, Groovatron time. Love that down there. Right, could do with some ammo. Oh, here we go. Right, let's use that. Shame I can't summon them. Um... Oh, maybe I can. There's one more here. Oh, yes, you're. Come back, Mrs. Zircon. I summon thee. Right, let's get rid of that. Purple brain monster. Right, that's that gone. Oh, it's another one. Cheeky. Two of you versus one. Well, I guess it's versus two, me and Clank. Clank doesn't help a lot. He doesn't do much. He just sits there warm on my back. Yeah, see, this one's got a green helmet on. So um, we want to get that to dance as well. There we go. Yeah, make him dance. They're sort of, they're the flying enemies, I guess. Right, once well, you've got them all, you're going to have to wait a minute now for um, Thingy to open the door. So uh, we'll just come around the back here, guys, and get the last Raritarium. There we go, last Raritarium, guys, on this level. We've got all the gold. No! Oh, whoa, that's close. Yeah, we've got all the Raritarium, all the gold bolts on this level. And there's no, there's no Rhino cards, so we don't need to worry about them. Right. Just waiting for this dude to open the door, and then we'll go and get the O2 mask. We'll do the last bit of this world. Um, we'll pop to Iridia, get the last gold bolt on there, which we couldn't get before. And then we've got every gold bolt on every level that we've done so far. And then we'll just go and do um, Qua, Qua 2 quickly. And uh, yeah, then we'll call it a day after that part. Right, let's get this done quickly. Right, take me back to my ship, guys, please. Right, yeah, we're not we're not quite done here yet, guys, but we are close to finishing this world. But Qua Qua Two just take probably about twenty minutes. I mean, there is a bit in the Qua Two where you play as Clank, and uh, there's two misc trophies which we we'll get there. There's three gold bolts. Um, what's it for? I think it's three. It's a bit uh, raritarian, but it's a boss. There is a boss there. I mean, it's a boss on this one, but I mean, I guess technically this one, not really a boss. I mean, you'll find out why in a second. Yeah, this we got to take out these babies. The caterpillar type things. Right, just wait near your ship. While I'm waiting, actually, I'll re refill my ammo. Oh yeah, and I can uh, upgrade my Groover bomb. Yes, there we go. Let's refill. Oh, I have already. Why, right, where is he? Come on, uh, scientist dude. Looks more like a dentist. Come on, Mr. Dentist. <laughs> yeah, you look more like a dentist. I'm not sure who um, fitted you out <laughs> making this game. 
Yeah, that's a scientist there, but let's give him dentist instruments. Instruments, yeah. Okay, so we've got to take out the hydro harvesters now. Use your Tesla rockets, okay. Right, so um, you know the score. Kill the smaller ships to build up your ammo. Yeah, really complicated stuff. And the fire missiles at the bigger ships. Yeah, I know it's working. Right, let's uh, shoot the smaller ones. Oh wait, oh no no, I've got a rocket here, I can shoot it. Here they come, this is what happens if you don't shoot any for f a few seconds. Right, let's go and get that one. Yeah, each one seems to take about four missiles. Failure is not an option, guys. Right, I need one more rocket, come on. Hey birdie, oh you're not going to have ammo. Oh, I've got it, I've got the ammo. Yeah, the green ones give you health, and the red ones seem to give you ammo. Yeah. I think I just shot a rocket then at one of the smaller ships. Yeah, sometimes if a ship's too far away, whoa, that you shoot, you may have to zoom towards it to get the ammo that it drops. Oh my gosh. Warning. Oh, I'm not doing all this again. Don't die, please. Yes, we did it. Got them all. Hydro harvesters destroyed. Splash down. Whee! To infinity. And beyond. Right, that's all the missions done here, apart from the optional one, which we're going to have to do because... Yeah, because we need the uh, my 2 mask... Yeah, and there is actually trespass a lot. There's actually locks through here as well. That's incredible, dentist. Yeah, I'll come and see you when I need my um, when I need my tooth, when I need my checkup doing. Yeah, we've got a sort of little jetpack thing now. You see? Yeah, we've got this little jetpack thingy. It's basically like another movement upgrade. We had the helicopter before. Well, it wasn't really a helicopter. It's more like um, Inspector Gadget's helicopter. You know, it doesn't really make you fly or anything. It just like hovers. It's more like a hovercopter. But um, yeah, you got to boost that now. I, I guess it when you dash forward, it makes you dash forward a bit quicker. So I'll quickly do this, then we'll go into that. Like I said, Iridia, get the last collectible there, and uh, go into the last um, third world. So we've got to come through here. That's a big mon. That's a big slime. Right, we'll leave him, we'll let Mr. Zircon distract him for a minute. And we're just going to lower the water level. Bloody hell, my kids are going mad. They go, I can hear my stairs going mad. I'm not sure if you guys can hear the thuds and bangs, but um, they're going mad upstairs. Right, so you need to, yeah, lower the water, unlock this, and you need to go and race it again. Yeah, so I'm going to do that one first. Um... Yeah, uh. Nope, that's not the one. Nope, <laughs> nope. Yes, that must go there. So, oh, that's one. It's nice when they just sl all slot into place. Right, that's a pool shark there. Right, we've got to go back up here now, guys, and, um. Yeah. Low, uh, race of water back. If I can get up. Can't believe Mr. Zircon didn't actually kill him. Yeah, them pool sharks, by the way. Don't worry, because we... You should have used a Groovatron. Oh, you mother... You mothers. Yes, guys. No, not yet. Let me do this first, guys, and then I'll see to you. Okay, um... You can go out the back, yes, but not out the front. What's happening? What's going on here, guys? <laughs> the water's raised, but, um... What the heck? Have I got metal... <laughs> I've turned into Metal Mario. I'm just sinking straight to the bottom. 
Okay, apparently the water has lost its um, particle effect. I don't know what. Okay, I'm going to have to quit, uh, quit and reload quickly, guys. I have no idea what has happened there. The water filled, but I think because I got damaged at the same time, it sort of half worked. <laughs> That's pretty weird. Because um, I quit and exit, I'm going to have to turn on fast mode again. There we go. Ah, now it's working. Right, so, um, just need to manage to pull this. Oh, here we go, quick. Before the Groovetron wears off. Yes, there we go. Right, so we do that, guys, then just make your way up. And get the O2, whoa! Oh, that was close. Get the O2 mask. There is a lock up here, which we need to do anyway. Obviously, of course, make sure you don't auto-hack it. Uh, right, let's do this. Obviously, them two go there. Oh, this one's pretty straightforward. Them two obviously go there. And, yes. Right, let's get the O2 mask. Yeah, you'd be quick here because um, these things will explode. Oh, shit, I'm going to run out of oxygen. Oh, so close. Right, Mrs. Zircon, I need you. I need your body. I think the enemies are too... No, for oh, fuck's sake. Get out of the way, you. Oh, here we go. Quick. Oh, just in time. Yes, and there's the O2 mask. We can breathe underwater now, guys. Yes, just that little tiny thing. Let's you breathe underwater. Right, let's head back to the ship. Right, here we are back um, at the start. Right, let's leave this fucking shitty planet. Waterworld. This one ain't too bad. Don't you get some nice upgrades here. I mean, you get two upgrades on this level, don't you? You get the um, O2 one. And, uh, yes, and you get the... Um, the little jetpack, well not jetpack, it's more like a sort of hover pack, I guess. Right, so we're going to Iridia first, guys. Iridia. Yes, that's the one. And, like I said earlier in, in the guide, you can actually get this um, gold bolt when you are doing the level, if you wanted to. If you, if you wanted to take time to learn the trick, you can. But we are doing it this way. Because this is where you're supposed to the get this way the developers want you to do it. And um yeah, it's a good idea to please the developers. I mean what we're doing here, we're actually getting the trophies that the developers set in the game. So come over here, this will warp you to the agent's camp, and you'll actually get some raritarium as well. Yeah, so there's a the raritarium. Uh over there. There we go. Raritarium. Okay, one of them didn't break. Right, so you're going to get swarmed by enemies. So just lob a Groover Tron down. So you don't get uh, interrupted. And this is what you do, yes. As you can see, you actually need this sort of jetpack. The hover the hover pack. I keep calling it a jetpack. What is it? Jet it's a hovercraft. A hover pack, technically. So it just makes you sort of hover. But it's got a jetpack sort of inside it. It's with limited functionality. So here's that third gold bolt. Yeah, you actually need this to um, use that lever. Yes, 19 out of 28. Right, let's go back to the ship and go to this last world we're going to do on this part. Right, back to the ship. Beam me up, Scotty. That's it, Clank. Where to, Clank? Yes, Quattol. Three gold bolts to get. Okay, so um, yeah, we get a Raritarium. Then we take care of Clank. Then we get a, another Raritarium with Crank. We get a Gold Bolt with Crank as well. Crank, Wank, Clank. Right, let's uh, grapple the heads. We should have full ammo, so I did remember buying full ammo um, back on uh, Pokitaru before he left. Right, so we've got to infiltrate the factory. Um, you'll have to kill these enemies here. Because you've got your friend with you and she will not follow you until all the enemies are dead. Let's 
Is that it? Oh, it's now. Right, sure it's going to hit the switch. Yeah, well, I'm not going to wait anywhere else. I mean, what, what am I going to do? Go back to the start and wait there? Of course not. Come on, let's go and progress the chapter. Right, you're going to have to kill all these enemies. So I'm just distracting with your dance moves. Or embarrass yourself, whatever you want to do. Yeah, you got a fucking turret here. So at least when they're dancing, the turret disables. Right, where's Mr. Zircon? Yeah, so you see, I'm, I'm using the um, Groovatron quite a lot. Do not be shy with the Groovatron. Do not be shy with it. Is that it? Oh, that's good timing. Out of ammo as well. Yeah, up here, guys. Raritarium. Uh, there we are. There we go. Raritarium. Right, and let's go and be Clank. Here we are. Send Wank to investigate. Be careful in there, Clank. It's a dangerous, dangerous place. You're on your own. Yeah, so um, that card in there, it's, it's not an important card, guys. It's just a, uh, it's just a random set. Right, so um, love that there. There are a few important collectibles when you get in here with Clank. So, um, but I will point them out to you. Right, put him over there. So we need that one. Oh shit! Ouch! I'm metal. Shouldn't hurt me. Right, lob him there. Get this one back. Make him into a bouncy board. There you are, my little trampoline friend. Get this one. Oi! Come with me if you want to live. Right, turn him into a uh, generator. And then go back and get the um, bouncy dude. Here, Mr. Springy. Right, lob him over there. Put a bit of spring in his step. Right, get the bomb. Well, actually, don't get the bomb yet. First, we need to make a bridge. There we go. Lob that bridge there. Lava's really hot. You do not want to go in the lava. Right, and uh, with the bomb, we can destroy this vent. Yes. And as you said, all the way across. Come on, I want to try and get this done before an hour. I'm on actually 47 minutes on my time at the moment. And I do need to cut a little bit off. I do want to cut off a few minutes. Right, lovely generator there. Sparky, little sparky there. Right, and uh, come straight over here where the pistons are. Le, le, le. Yeah, you can't... I mean, if you just put a controller down, you can't die here. But if you try and move left, you will die. Yes. Player's input can actually kill you there. Right, do not let them blow up next to you because they will kill you. Yes, they will kill you. Right, open the door, grab a little sparky here. Right, and what we're going to do now, we're going to bring him over here and we're going to kill him. Yes, I'm going to kill a little, little friend here. Yes, it's alright. It's alright, you can kill him. Oh, so sad. Yeah, basically you want to do that five times, guys. For a trophy. Kill him five times for a trophy. That's two. Yes, three. I'll sort you out in a minute, mate. I, I wish you wouldn't. Kids, but he got all dirty. That's four. Right, one more time. Five, basically got to uh, kill him five times. There we go, Clank Crusher. Sorry, Clank. I crushed you now. Now you're a plank. Crush you into a plank. The clank becomes a plank. Right, when the hero becomes a villain. Right, I need you. Come with me. Right, bring him over here. Lob him down there. Power that generator. Make this one into a bridge. Then you take this one back. Uh, you need to take him from this side, obviously, because this is the side we made him from. Or whatever, it doesn't matter what one you do, you just need to take one of them down. Lo well, I guess it's this one, because you need the bridge to leave him there. Get off me! You're not coming with me, just stay there. What happened? Okay. Apparently he's not close enough. Yes, well done. That's what you were created to do, so do it. 
Right, come into this door ahead. Boom. Come through here. Grab the bomb. Destroy the robots. Clank doesn't mess about. Look at this. One hit kills. Yeah, the one with the lights flashing. You may not notice this, but the, the doors with the flashing lights are the ones that are going to open next. Yes. Yeah, it may not be quite clear to you, so I um, just wanted to explain that. He just melee'd me, cheeky bastard. Yeah, two come out of this one. Boom, I got them both. Let's get some energy back. Right, and you need to take a bomb with you because there's a vent you need to destroy. There it is. And through there is another vent with a gold bolt, so you can take another bomb with you. I'm not sure if I can reach it. Um, if not, we're just going to have to come back and get that bomb in a minute. I just want to check. I've not tried this yet. Normally, you have to get up there. Uh, okay. Nope. <laughs> okay. I'll have to do that in a bit. Okay, so um, we're going to go and get the um, two... Get the two um, gadget bots. Well, no, 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 no. I need to get over there. Little little game of Frogger, this. A little game, 3D game of Frogger, I guess. Right, leave them there for a minute because we want to get... No, get off me. It's my Raritarium. Yeah, some Raritarium. There we go. Three Raritarium. Okay, we've got to take gadget bot back over there. Right, we're going to make him into a little springy board. There we go. We'll leave him there for a second. We'll go and get the other gadget bot. Yeah, there's a um, rhino, uh, not a rhino card, a normal card. You don't need it because it's just a normal random set or random card you'll get. Right, take this gadget bot. And we're going to use him to make a bridge. Yeah, you you were created to make a bridge for me. So right, leave him there. Get this one. Spring bot. And now we need to go back and get that bomb. Yeah, that's why I try to see if you can blow it up from the bottom. So it saves you running all the way back through here. But it's, it's not the end of the world. Clank has got infinite power. So it doesn't really waste any of his um, battery coming through there and going back. Right. There we go. Gold Bolt. And that is Gold Bolt number one on this bit. Yeah, Gold Bolt 20. Make sure you take this back down with you. Um, so you need to power each of these generators now. And that one. And we'll get the last one. Yeah, this bit is clank. It's quite. I guess this bit's quite long as clank, isn't it? Right, once you power them all, we can press the switch. There we go. And that's Clank's bit. <laughs> okay, so um, this door's open, guys. Sorry, duty called for a minute there. So, um, I shouldn't be too long doing this. Right, so um, I think they're a new enemy type. So, um, yeah, Groovatron, Mr. Zircon. And uh, you, you will need to uh, kill these because otherwise... Um, your friend, she, yeah, she will not open the door for you. Yeah, I think that's all of them. Yeah, here she comes. I need some more ammo for my uh, combustor. Right. Oh, look at that. The factory. Where? I don't see. All I see is conveyor belts. Oh, conflicting feelings. I see. Oh, ammo. Yes, thank you. Yes, please. Lock and loaded. Right, guys. So, um, yeah, just heading along for a minute there. Nothing to collect for the time being. And we've got most of these enemy types. Well, you should know if you've got them all. If you haven't got all these enemy types... Oh, damn. Alright, here's a collectible. Right, let's lob a Groovatron down. Cool, Mr. Zircon. Right, let's take them all out. Right, you need to use that turret and you need to destroy that uh, barrier there with the turret. There we go, because in there is the rhino card that we need. Not the card we deserve, but the card that we need. Yes, and that is rhino card number... 
Rhino card number seven. So we just need two more. Right, so um, let's move on. Watch yourself over here. Yep, no shit. Yes, here we go. Oh no, not Zircons. I'll have to call Mr. Zircon to defeat his own kind. Don't worry. Not bad, right, I bet you're wondering what I'm doing here. So these inactive warbots, you need to destroy 10 of these for a MISC trophy. Yeah, try not to let them kill you. Yeah, they are inactive. But I would say, just be careful guys, you got to kill 10 of these. Yeah, if you think you're going to get hit by one, just um, jump back or some, uh, you know, dash back quickly and you dodge its attack. It's a um, stationary attack where it attacks you without moving. Yeah, so um, just watch out for that. So yeah, you got to destroy 10 and you'll get a MISC trophy. Yeah, Miss Zircon, Mr. Zircon, as you can see, he's, uh, he's too afraid. To hit these, he's afraid of the re retaliation, vengeance of any comeback he might get. And I almost bloody ran off the edge there of the conveyor belt. There we go, war bots into plowshares. Yeah, once you got that trophy, we can move on. Ouch, okay, probably not a good idea to run into that. Or that one. <laughs> oh, yes, health. Yes, please. Right, you don't need to really kill any of these. Right, there's a the trespass lock, and then we can get the jetpack, guys. Um, so that one, you actually don't need to use that one. It's these three here, these two. No, so obviously that goes there, and they go there. Yeah, that one's pretty easy. The outer ring, you need to deactivate it. Right, and uh, okay. yeah, we've got a jetpack time, guys. Right, so what we need to do now, we need to defeat the um, all the warbots that come out to you. Yeah, these three warbots, warbots remain, you've got to defeat them all, guys. So, I mean, the, the closer you get to these, the more you're going to hit with your combustor. And um, there are a few collectibles, but we'll get them in a minute. We'll just get rid of these guys first. Uh, Mr. Zircon. I call thee to my side. Right. Three remaining. Where are they? I'm here. Oh, you're not talking to me. Alright, two left. Oh, got no ammo. Let's switch to a predator. I can do it from a distance then. Oh, level up. Right, that should be it. No, it's still going. Damn, he was made with. He was, whoever made him did a, did a good job. Right, once you've killed that one, guys, you should be able to enter. Yeah, that room over there. Holy shit, I'm going to die in a minute. Right, um, yeah, I just want to kill them because I want to just um, refill my ammo here, guys. And then press the switch, and that will summon the boss. Yeah, it's a little boss fight now. Yeah, right, let's go and kill the boss. What's my health like? Did it refill my health? Right, so, um, yeah, obviously make the boss dance. It's a new enemy type, of course, so make him dance. And um, just kill him after that. This boss is, can be a good place to um, level your weapons. And um, there's a better spot later. Yeah, when he uses barrier, you can just uh, call a Groovatron, and that will stun him and deactivate it. Yeah, you can keep hitting him with different weapons. Then when you run out of ammo, um, just jump off the edge and kill yourself. Um, and basically, you just keep doing that um, to level up your weapons. But we'll be doing we'll be doing that on the last boss later. Um, so you don't really need to do it now. 
Right, okay, his shield is down, but no. His shield is still there, I don't know why. Okay, got one more Groovatron left. Okay, so I thought it would deactivate it. Doesn't always, I guess. Right, once you killed him, Zircon family values. Yeah, you get a trophy for that. Right, do not, do not, where is it? You're supposed to go over there, but do not go and do the lock yet. There's a few collectibles we want to get first. Right, and uh, let's go and do them. Where are we? Okay, so we're going over here first, guys, this little lock. So um, I'm just on this side at the moment. So I'm going to unlock this one. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. I think it's going to take me a minute or two to... Uh... No, that's the wrong one. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, it went too bad. Yeah, once you've done that, guys, obviously you can come in here and turn this lever. If I can find it. Yes, there we go. If I can find the interaction point. Yes, and there's a the gold vault. And if you remember, we actually came in here right at the start of the game as Clank. Do you remember this place? Yeah, get us gold bolt. That's uh, gold bolt number two. Uh, in this area. Yeah, actually gold bolt tw number 21 in total. Yeah, right. So, um, I'm going to get a raritarium now. Where is the raritarium? I think that's just over here. Just the next like, one we just came out of. So, here's the raritarium, guys. Just in here. We'll grab that. And now there's a door we need to go in, um, which has got another switch inside. Um, I think it's this one over here. Yeah, so this switch here, guys. This is where we are. Come over here. Press that switch, and it will release this force field on the middle. And we can get the last gold bolt. Yes, on the um, production line. Just through there. That uh, should be gold bolt 22, guys. Yes, 22. And that's it. Uh, we've done everything here, guys, that we need to do. So uh, we can move on now. So um, just come over to here. We've got all the Mystic Trophies. Let's do this last lock. Right, so... Uh, yeah, that, I guess that one goes there. No, no. I think this one goes... Yes, that goes there, and we've got one more here, yes that's it, and as soon as you pick that lock, that'll be it guys, there'll be a little cutscene now, yes, so uh, yeah, we've done it, we've done the factory, we've got all the collectibles in here, we've got the rhino card, we've got three gold bolts, and we've got the rare Raritarium deposits, which are not really a main collectible anyway. But um, yeah, you can go on the Deplanetizer now. Yeah, we've got all the gold bolts so far, guys. Right, so um, yeah, that's it, guys, for this part. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you again on the Deplanetizer. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you on the next part.